Another dangerous day in New York City subways where at least three different riders fell onto the tracks. A man died in Queens when he was hit by a train. Two others, one in Brooklyn, another in Times Square, survived with the help of Good Samaritans. And News 4's Adam Harding is live in Times Square. And Adam, you did speak exclusively with a pair who pulled one of those people back onto the platform. And David, good evening to you. These two do not want to be called heroes. They simply saw what was unfolding in front of them. They did not hesitate because they had no time to hesitate. That's because as they were jumping down, a train was pulling in. Cell phone video showing the Good Samaritans hoisting the man up to safety after he had fallen onto the tracks late Wednesday at the busy Times Square subway station. No time for hesitation. It was just, like I said, fortunate enough to be there. We are co working to save this man's life. Dennis Popovich still doesn't know what exactly happened to the man. He and his co worker, Eamon Carey, simply jumped down to help when they saw him lying face down in danger. I didn't really know what was happening until I got to the edge of the platform. I hadn't seen the guy fall, so, um, and Dennis didn't hesitate for a second, so we had no conversation. It was train coming, but it was uh, further enough away, so we can we have enough time. It was another, what, 15 seconds by the time the train arrived after we pulled him up, so. But you knew you only had so much time. Oh, there was uh, not, not, not much time, believe me. About an hour later in Park Slope, Brooklyn, there was another rescue. After police say a man fell onto the tracks at the 4th Ave 9th Street Station. He and a good Samaritan rolled under the platform as a train was pulling in, narrowly avoiding being hit. It was the wildest thing. I was actually pretty amazed by hearing that somebody actually jumped down into the train station to actually save someone, but that's the wildest thing. New York is crazy. New York is definitely crazy. And in Queens, police say they're investigating after a man in his 30s ended up on the seven tracks at Junction Boulevard. He was struck and killed by a train after slipping off the platform. Three separate cases highlighting potential danger underground. I just think that it's the right thing to do. That's all it is. As for these two in Times Square, they're not looking for any attention. They just reacted. God forbid some happened to me tomorrow. I'm hoping somebody will jump and do that, do the same thing. So it is still unclear exactly what happened in the case here at Times Square, but those two Good Samaritans tell me they waited for first responders to arrive before they continued with their travels. I asked them what they would like to say if the guy was watching, if he could hear their message tonight, what they had to say. Their message to him tonight is live your life well. We're live tonight in Times Square. I'm Adam Harding, News 4, New York.